I'm Samantha Loren, your St. Martin Parish reporter. If you've been to downtown Bro Bridge, you may have seen one local artist's work taking over storefront windows. Jess Newton's murals are taking over a strip of Main Street in downtown Bro Bridge. Each window decorated for the holidays, matching the persona of each store. Usually they ask me, um, what I want to do. And so I send them a bunch of really neat ideas and I think, oh, this will look good on your window and they usually like the ideas. Monroe's boutique owner, Kathy Quinn, whose window features Marilyn Monroe murals, says she's seen positive reactions from the public. They just love it. It just glistens at night. We have glitter and pearls and it's just fun. It's just us. Newton says it took her three weeks to complete three storefront windows and just this morning Newton finished her latest. I just finished a nativity and an angel on the salon right by the church, from the St. Bernard Church. They wanted it to kind of represent the little area that they're in. Newton, who is currently working with Bro Bridge Tourism, says it's about giving back to the community through her artwork. I do a lot of community work. I'm fixing some signs at the veterans home, um, helping them out, get some, some beautification. I started a, a group online for, called the Bro Bridge Volunteer Beautification Group. <laughs> And we get together and we find projects in the area that need help. Newton says she would like to start a Brobridge mural company to help fill the public art need. I want to start an official artist community in St. Martin Parish because I've been talking to the local tourism offices and they really have a strong need for more public art more murals, more electric box coverings, more window paintings. Newton says she enjoys seeing the community's positive feedback to her artwork. The community really loves it because they're just like, oh, you're bringing so much joy. Oh, you're making me smile. I brought my kids downtown. And usually they wouldn't have, you know. It, it's just kind of bringing a community together a little bit more, too. Troven company owner Paula Daron says Newton incorporated self-portraits of her and her husband in her storefront murals. We were under construction and we're going to put brown paper and thought that this was a way funner way to, uh, you know, bring in Christmas with the construction and let people know that we were going to be expanding. Newton says her next project is creating a mural in the new St. Martin Parish Tourism Building. Reporting in St. Martin Parish, Samantha Loren, KTC TV3.